Weekly beds, can all the meditation and talk about it. Blessings to everybody out there for your going out and your coming in. Be safe out there in the world. Keep your eye open. Don't make those stress out or bother you because stress is not really too good for the brain. Alright? Make we get into it. I'm telling you something. This is Tesha Miller. I appeal in sentence in a court. And if I say the judge never really give a fair trial. And the person who come as a witness and testify against him, then pay him because he had a life sentence and then jump it down from a life sentence to 10 years. And him get almost 39 years him get. Him almost get more 39 years. Him appeal fame sentence. And honestly, me feel like he's going to win it. I feel like he's going to win his appeal. I'm not advocating for him to win his appeal, but you see the justice system in Jamaica? Because they are using emotions and control and power they don't realize that a lot of these cases that they are just okay well life me are in prison they are doing it off of emotions you are too attached to the case and when you're too attached to the case you can allow these people to walk okay if you look at how America courthouse deal with certain cases, the judge that assigned to it, he's not in the circle of knowing about this person, personal life. The judge in Jamaica, they know so much about these people, personal life, where whatever they hear, whether they're guilty or not guilty, the judge already make up in a feel mind where him feel like should happen. And that's where you are judging off of emotions. And when you do things off of emotions, this is going to be the outcome of him going to appeal. He's going to appeal his case and he's going to win. If he does not win, that's a good thing. If he wins, it's a bad thing. Stop judge after emotions. Use the evidence that's in front of you to make a good decision. And when appeal there come around, you can win the appeal again and keep that person in jail.